We're rolling, Bob. Chestnuts roasting on an open fire. Hey, you know, um, Captain Cook, he got his chestnuts roasted on an open fire by the Hawaiians. <laughs> And, you know, I think he had a romance while he was there because that um, half Hawaiian, half English son of the Hawaiian woman, guess who? Sam Cook. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> Captain Cook. Sam Cook. He, the, the cannibals ate him. Yes, they did. They sure did. Good job. Good job, guys. Name of the show tonight? Uh, hold it. <laughs> no, not that. <laughs> um, Merry Christmas in the meaning of life. Only I had. Do you have any Christmas songs? You gotta have one or two. We got a few that we've done recently. Merry Christmas in the meaning of life, and then tomorrow night will be Merry Christmas and the secret to happiness. Okay. But I'll also tell you that tonight. Too. Okay. Because they kind of go together, you know, like love and marriage. Are you going to give me that hat or Get your guitar on first. <sighs> okay, jump in the limo. We sent the limo for you, so just jump in the back uh, the back of the limo because we got to take a ride out the country road. It should be like snowy in Christmas out there in the cornfield where the old artists come out and get us uh, requests their songs and we sing them really weirdly. Uh-huh. Not weirdly. Good. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but right now, get in the limbo because uh, Jimmy Joe, your driver, he's turning the radio on. He's taking us back to the 1960s. He's taking us back to Ray Charles and Merle Haggard. Yes, he is, Dad. Yes, he is. But actually, it's Don Gibson, Ray Charles and Merle Haggard, because Don, you know, the uncle of uh, an old girlfriend of mine, uh -huh. actually wrote it. Uh -huh. Just because Ray made all the money on it. Yeah. You know, Don, he, Don, I think, I don't know if Don got number one on the country. Chart. Yeah. I don't know either. But Ray always took him and crossed him over and just did things. So he could have <laughs> six wives <laughs> and a lot of dope. Yep. There he it is. He did well for himself. Now, why is this a con uh, uh, Christmas song, Mo? Is it up here? No. no, it's in G sharp. You G moved, sharp. You that's moved what it I said. From what yeah. I had it at. Why is this a Christmas song? Because this is how everybody feels at Christmas. Yep. Sure thing. No, it's because country music is medicinal, man. It's a medicinal. It's the most medicinal music. Yeah. There is, I think. Yeah. It's like because of the stories, Mo. Yeah. It makes you laugh. It makes you cry. It makes you go, hmm. It's just talking. Talk therapy, music therapy, <laughs> family therapy, and laugh therapy. Surely to God we're going to laugh about something tonight, aren't we, Mo? I hope so, Dad. War, sin, a killing, and a robbing. They say that the world is a one big problem. I got one to tell you now. I can't find my darn old cow. We'll just leave it. Just leave it at that. Maybe it'll come out of the corn peel. Not poor shitty. I can't stop loving you. I said I made up my mind to live in the memory of a lonesome time. I can't stop loving you. Oh, it's just useless to say. So I'll just live my life in dreams of yesterday. Dreams of yesterday. Those happy hours. Those happy hours. That we once knew. That we once knew. So long ago. So long ago. Still make me blue. Still make me blue. Oh, you know they say that time. They say the time He is a broken heart He is a broken heart yeah, But the time has stood still. still 
since we've been apart oh, I can't stop loving you I said I made up my mind To live in the memory Of a lonesome time I can't stop wanting you Oh, it's just useless to say So I'll just live my life In dreams of yesterday Dreams of yesterday Yesterday All my troubles seem so far away Now it looks as though they're here to stay I believe in Merle Haggard. Today I, I started loving you again. Now I'm right back where I really always been. I got over you just long enough to. Let my heart ache, man. And then today, I started loving you again. Yeah, today I started loving you again. Oh, what a fool I was to think I could get by. Only these few million tears I cry Oh, how will I To know the worst Will yet to come And that crying time For me had just begun And then the day I started loving you I'm right back where I really always been. I got over you just long enough to let my heart in me. And in a day, I started loving you again. And in a day, Started loving you again, and then today I started loving you again. Mer hey, what was that the name of the guy that killed in that that song? You know the Earl. Oh, not Merle, though. No. <laughs> okay, no. Couldn't have been I Merle. I thought, oh, they didn't to say Merle. Merle, did they? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's Earl. That bad man, Earl. I, t I did a tweet today, and I called, what did I say again? The way of the monkey is the way of man. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> it's just because I watched this movie about that true movie, uh, true Nicolas Cage, The Lord of War. Oh, yeah. And you know how they're pumping all the money into Ukraine? Uh -huh. Well, just a few years ago when they decided they weren't going to have the communist thing anymore yeah. over there, yeah. the Ukrainian generals stole $320 billion worth of armaments and sold them. Oh, man. The, the, you know what I mean? Two sides to every story. <laughs> it's going on right now down there. We're pumping the money over. Oh, my God. Well. It's a family feud. Yeah. I don't know. I'm not involved. It's not my family. Family feuds are usually the worst ones. Let us. Of course they are because it's the closest to the DNA, which is the closest to the damn, uh, you know, what I'm talking about, evolution. This time it's personal. Let's take a ride. Oh, okay. Take a ride. Take a ride. Roberta, no. Gonna take a ride. 
gonna take it right. I'll pass a honky tone. Pass a honky tone. Pass a county line. And a county line. Through the amber waves of grain. Those waves of grain. And past the dairy cow. With the big brown eye. To the old cornfield of green. Cornfield of dreams. Cornfield of dreams. Cornfield of dreams. Who's coming out today, Ma? I can't see only Malka. Johnny Cash and Hank Snow dead. Johnny wants this. I met her accidentally in St. Paul, Minnesota. Told me up every time I heard that drawl, heard the southern drawl. Oh, he took my dream back downstream, cavorting in the Davenport. And then I followed you, Big River, when you called. Followed you, Big River, when you called. Don't you batten down my Baton Rouge, River Queen, rolling on. Take that woman on down, down to New Orleans, down to New Orleans. Oh, go on. I've had enough. Dump my blues way down in the Gulf. I said that she loves you, Big River. More than me. She loves you, Big River, more than me. Yes, Biggie, we the moment down the track to me. True love and daddy come back and I'm moving on. Hey, I'm a rolling on. I'm rolling on. You keep a shoveling the coal, keep a rattling the road, and keep moving on. Well, Mr. Fireman, won't you please listen to me? Oh, God, pretty mama down in Tennessee, keep moving me on. I'll keep a rolling on. Keep a rolling on. Keep a shoveling the coal, keep a rattling the road, and keep moving on. Oh, rip it, well, there was some deep baby when you've had your play You gon' want your daddy, but your daddy gon' say keep moving on You stayed away too long You had to laugh on me and I said to free and I'm moving on the band's getting better, don't you think? <laughs> They're trying their best. Oh, I'm going. Yeah. Remember when we were talking about freedom uh-huh. and it, how complex it was and all that? And I was really worried because I couldn't figure out exactly, what, you know, yeah. I got deep, it's very yeah. deep. Yeah. Well, I got myself straightened out, was listening to the radio, uh-huh. and there's no question about it. Freedom. That's not freedom. I'm not talking about freedom. Freedom is what we're talking about before. We're talking about love. Yeah. Oh, Jesus, I blew that, didn't mm. I? I was walking right into it. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> well, that's normal. Could have fooled me. Love is the word we're talking about. <laughs> we already did the freedom one. Yeah. Oh, I could do it again on the freedom, but no, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> is that, no, because the, what I learned was about love. Right. Okay. Because I'm a little, you know, it used to be a word that wasn't used that much. Now it's everywhere, yeah. all the time. Yeah. Right? And I found out why. Why? Because there's less of it? No. It's two pair of glasses for $99. I heard it right on the radio. Uh huh. Said that's love. The I glasses company. Uh huh. The advertisement is. Yeah, yeah. Love. W- love yeah. from me to you. Yeah. Two pair of glasses for $99. Yeah. Have you got it now? Yeah. Okay. I get it. <laughs> I get it. Somebody thinks it's funny. That's I thought we were talking. I thought it was going to be a heavy thing. Aren't we going to talk about that? She's no. Why they it would take love the whole show things because 
people didn't get enough love in their childhood? Yeah, well, that's something I'd have to <laughs> put out to the R&D department. Research on that. She's a marijuana lady. Yeah, she's a marijuana girl. Hey, I got a new... Oh, I think it'll be down in the good book somewhere. Uh, when I was looking at the repertoire for Christmas, I saw a song I was supposed to write, uh-huh. and I didn't write it. Oh. And, what uh, was it? It was... Uh, have a... Holly, no, a uh, holly. Oh, have a good old holly jolly, uh-huh. and keep your toys in the sack. <laughs> <laughs> have a good old holly jolly and keep your toys in the sack. Ta- your toys. Yeah. So in the sack. Yeah, put, keep your toys in the sack. <laughs> and look at that. But who wrote this? How much do you? I think Bob Dylan wrote this. Okay. Watch this. How much do you reflect? Do you deflect? Do you reject? Do you neglect? And what anybody expect? <laughs> Gratitude is part of reflection, you know? Yeah. I just stuck that at the bottom because all the rest had no meaning whatsoever. Yeah. Which is the way Bob does it, and that's the way they make the most money. You just throw out something, they have no idea what it is, and all everybody goes, ooh, that's heavy. Yeah. Answer's blowing in the wind. Yeah. I think the answer is blowing in Bob's a billion dollar bank account. <laughs> <laughs> he just sold his, you know. Uh, Let's finish the ride and get out to the station. Everybody get back in the limo and get on that old country road, that old county line road. Yeah, let's get back out to the station. Am I getting paid? Okay. Um. Yeah, I was supposed to go war sin killing and robbing and say the whole one big problem I got one I'm telling you now if I'm an old dirt old cow. Yeah. Y'all look like you're getting real ready to get the most unique and entertaining educational experience you ever had right here on the really big old time radio medicine show. There you go. Okay. What do you got? The girly toes. All the girlies toes were All leaving the corner. Toes. Hanging out the window. Hanging out of the window. And somebody sees a great big tower, old radio tower, 50,000 watts. Station GHRT. Station GHRT. It's there for you and me. It's there for you and me. Oh, pop, pop, badio, badio, pop, pop, Brought to you by Alice's Restaurant and General Store. Down at Alice's Restaurant, down at Alice's Alice's restaurant. Pull in the station, go up to the front desk and see Betty Page in her cigarette girl uniform. She give you your special tea with the ayahuasca in it and send you downstairs to the psychedelic prairie home companion. The really big old time radio medicine show, Three Chords and the Truth, starring Molly Griffin and her old dog Duke. And the Reverend Dr. Joe G2 coming to you live from Station GHRT in the virtual haystack in your mind. Where the show always starts in five minutes. And we don't spin the tunes on the turntable, we spin them on our souls. So kick back, chill out. Spin them on our souls. And relax to the mellow sounds. Spin them on our hearts. Singing DJ. Gonna sing a, a at least a one song, one Christmas song. Yeah. You got one down there. Yeah. Okay. I do. It's a really big show. <laughs> <laughs> well, here's an interesting fact. What? Now that eighty percent of television advertising is pharmaceutical drugs. Uh huh. Don't you think that's quite telling? in America yeah. is big pharma drugs. Would you not agree that the new American dream is anti-hopelessness that which comes in a pill? Yeah. Huh? It's not very good. <laughs> it's not a very good situation. I got I I'm going to keep pointing the shit out yeah. about m- mental health. Uh-huh. Until there's no more sandy hooks. Yeah. I'm not forgetting that. Yeah. 
What do you got now? We have got. Well, why do you do your? Uh, no, let's do just when I needed you most. Sleigh bells ring. Are you listening? Do you know what key we play that in? Uh, C. Way up there. That's what it says. Just let me check that out. If I hit it real soft, it's not as much out of tune, Mom. Sleigh bells ring, are you listening? In the lane, snow's glistening. Beautiful sight, happy night. Walking in a winter wonderland. Gone away is a bluebird. Here to stay is a new bird. Songs we roll along, walking in a winter wonderland. In the meadow, we can build a snowman. And pretend that he is parson brown. And say, I am married, we'll say, No man. You can do the job when you're in town. Hey, later on, we'll conspire as we dream by the fire. Face on a bed, the plans that we made, walking in a winter wonderland. Walking in a winter wonderland. I just remembered that, you know, that little bit I did at the beginning about uh, Captain Cook getting his ch- chestnuts roasted? Yeah. I was supposed to follow that with. Melakaliki Maka is her wise way. Well, that's in an F sharp. Do you want to do that one? Okay. We'll just get the Christmas part over. Yeah. Because no, everybody hates it, right? <laughs> yeah, no one likes it. Getting no good feedback on the Christmas show. The Christmas stuff that go to. Never mind. Can you hear me? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, I'm definitely not saying that. So let's get that over. We there. are saying. No, no I'm not saying none of that either. Bad. Okay, you ready to go? Thing yeah, we're gonna sing about the guys that uh, roasted uh, Captain Cook's uh, chestnut. Hawaiian Christmas Day. And, and uh, they let the mother uh, live, uh-huh. and she had Sam Cook. <laughs> but he he got his, he got his chestnuts roasted too. That was dirty. Yep. That was real dirty. Yeah. I didn't mind about Captain Cook. No, I think that was warranted. But Sam, that was not good. That was not warranted. That was just not a good thing. <sighs> anyway, let's sing this Christmas song. <laughs> As if he had to go out with bit ten dollar hookers. Bit of a da- Every <laughs> woman in the bloody country. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah. I know. Bullshit. I know. Right. It's bad. It was Bullshit. a dirty deal. Dirty deal. All right. What do you want out of me now? <laughs> Oh, is it? Do we play that in like an E or a C? Uh, a F, G. F sharp. No, the style. Oh, like a an E. Yeah. Bing Crosby. I'm gonna just sing it just like Bing Crosby. My little can you get my girl is her wise way to say Merry Christmas to you. That's the island greeting we will send to you From the land where the palm trees sway Here we know that Christmas will be Green and bright, oh, sun shines every day And all the stars at night Oh, I said, Mela, Maliki Maka is wise way to say Merry Christmas to you. Melakalekimaka is the thing to say on a bright Hawaiian Christmas Day. On a bright Hawaiian Christmas Day. Let's see Adam greeting we will send to you from the land where palm trees sway. Oh, look at them sway. 
Hey, we know that Christmas will be green, green and bright. Oh, the sun shines every day, and all those stars at night. Oh, I said, Mella, Billy Mark. A wise way to say Merry Christmas to you. A Mella Kaliki Maka. A wise way. Say Merry Christmas to you. That's the island greeting we will send to you. From the land where palm trees sway. Oh, here we know that Christmas will be green and bright. Oh, the sun shines every day and all the stars at night. Oh, I said, Mella, the Licky Maka, Hawaii's way to say Merry Christmas, to say Merry Christmas, to say Merry Christmas to you. Nashville Vaudeville. <laughs> oh, my God. I don't want to say none of that either. There's some funny shit down here somewhere, Ma. I know. You got a lot of serious stuff. Oh, this is really serious, but I think it's important. Oh, wait a minute. I, I got to get do. to the meaning of life. <laughs> Holy shit. Where is it? You're about a cooperation. Oh, I'm not going to have. What time is it? Oh, I'm not going to have time. No. I got to get the meaning of life out, and I got to get it out quick. Real quick. <laughs> Oh, God, that's the good stuff. We're putting that shit in the next show. <laughs> it was about Muse. I looked it up. Okay. Um, I think I might have been in my... Oh, yeah. Never mind that. Oh, here it is right here, Mo. Okay. Oh, yeah, we got it. <laughs> As if I don't know, right? As if I can't just tell you. Yeah. The source or impetus of all human motivation is to evolve. This is science now. This is not a notion. There's all kinds of people out there touting off where well, you get where happiness is from and all that kind of crap. Those are good. It's all good stuff. You know, have gratitude, all that kind of stuff, right? It's all good. But this is the science, babe. This is your brain. Is to evolve yourself, your brain, and guess what? Your DNA. And this is not in contradiction with spirituality. It's actually synergistic or in harmony with, with spirituality because for God's sake, where are you going with your evolution, eh? Yeah, where are you That's, going? yeah, the only answer we got to that is a spiritual answer. <laughs> I don't care how many rockets they send out there, Mom. Rockets. There you go. I got the meaning of life in. There you go. You got you got a song that goes good with it. Um, Fort Worth or Glory Days? Which one do you want? Hmm. Oh, Fort Worth, George Strait. Yeah. No, oh, I'm gonna do George Strait. Okay. Because I was thinking about how good George's stuff was. Mm -hmm. Yeah, good, good, good machine. The George Strait machine. You know the writers. Yeah. Producers. Yeah. Whole thing. Yeah. Uh, and the right guy. Yeah. You know, it's a pretty big deal. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Sure as hell yep. is. And remember. And his wife. Love. Two pair of glasses for $99. What? <laughs> what did you say? And I, s I added George Strait's wife. It's always the wife. And that house of his that I want down there in uh, El Paso or wherever it is. Mm -hmm. It's pretty nice. Down in the West Texas. You dropped the price in West half. Texas town? Yeah. Of El Paso? <laughs> about, I think it's El Paso. Uh, anyway, let's sing yeah, forward. Let's, let's do it. Do it. Let's, let's do it. Let's do it. it. Okay, you ready? Yeah. This is a song about me. Uh, I almost got killed down in. Uh, what's the one right beside Port Worth? Dallas. Dallas. That's where I was. Whew. Taken by Alice down in Dallas. <laughs> <laughs> I'd never take any of that shit, man. It probably killed me. <laughs> you know, I didn't steal that from anybody. That's original. I know. Vials down in Dallas. <laughs>
happened exactly like this with me. I had a bunch of guys chasing me with axe handles. I bet you did. I must have said the wrong thing, Mom. <laughs> Cold forward beard just ain't no good for jealous. I try it nine after nine. You're in someone else's arms down there in Dallas. The sport ever cross your mind. Darling, while you're busy burning bridges, burn one for me if you get time. Cause good memories that don't fade so easy, and to sport worth ever cross your mind. And I know it hurt you at the time Not as much as the action I wonder now it makes any difference The sport worth ever cross your mind The sport worth ever the sport worth it. The sport worth ever cries your mind. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'll just stick the happiness in because uh, I already told you that your brain uh -huh. is obsessed with evolving, actually. Yeah. Yeah, uh, you and your DNA and the whole kit and caboodle. That's why everybody's killing each other over there. It's behind almost everything, everything we do, all eight billion. But anyways, and the secret to happiness is to cooperate with your brain, right? You know, you can go down, you can go on down a Griffin Art Patreon, or into it head down and dirty down there. Yes, siri, Barbarino. Now what? Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> We're all about health, of course. Talk, music, laugh, and what else? Family therapy. Talk, music, laugh, and family therapy. So you all come back now here because uh, when you got your health, you got just about everything. So you people can hear Billy. You come on back.